Thank you. And uh, welcome to uh, Old County Nebraska. My name is Senator, ex Senator Cat Hurd. I was a member of the legislature for 20 years. And uh, during that time, I don't think it was a year went by that we didn't study or discuss water issues in the National Resources Committee. It's just part of the business. So we aren't exactly uh, uneducated along those lines. I think we know quite a little bit about water movement and how to protect our offices. Uh, I live in the greatest nation in the world. Uh, the only known constitutional republic that survived over 200 years. Why did those other constitutional republics not survive? Because of greed. We are part of the uh, people who want power. We are the part of those who want money. And we are the part of those who uh, want land. We have, by way of the Constitution, set up a system in this country called capitalism. Capitalism is what made this country great. I mean, you might care compare this to socialism or communism or Nazism. Capitalism is the thing that made this country great. With a certain amount of difficulty among our capitalists, going to agree now, we can get in front, and that's one of the things I want to counsel about today. I'm also a resident of the greatest state in the nation. Thank you. Some might uh, argue with me about that, but I've always felt that I've never felt like there was any state in the nation that served the citizens better than the rest. We are, at this point, the most economically efficient state in the nation, number one. I wonder why that is. We have the greatest agricultural, agricultural economy in the, in the nation. And the reason we have the greatest economy, uh, agricultural economy in the nation is because we've got that offer. We're able to produce more than enough to feed all the cattle we feed, plus have enough left over to provide all the ethanol we need. And someone mentioned something a little bit ago about the, uh, some of the toxins in our uh, water systems and our natural resources. One of the reasons that the storage tanks had difficulties is because they were storing gasoline with MTBE in it. MTBE, MTBE is methyl structural butylic acid, and it's a, it's a carcinogen. That was, the, that was why Congress ordered us to find a different way of uh, providing that, that part of our gas. So we're using ethanol to do that. Ethanol doesn't have the toxicity. As someone mentioned a little bit ago, ethanol is a, can, can drop through all the story, underground storage tanks. Don't bother me. Uh, <clears throat> I am also a graduate veterinarian from uh, Kansas State University in 1961, and I practiced veterinary medicine here in this area for a year. As a matter of fact, I came to, I was from New England, Nebraska, but I came to Athens and every Tuesday and respected the Athens and Livestock. We have a problem in this country with, uh, with uh, safety in our food animals. And we need to, uh, and butter and are on the front line with this effort. Uh, I wanted to add one more thing before I quit and see if I can notice I, I'm also a rancher. I am the fourth generation in a ranch that both lived on the great grandfather in 1883. I've been managing this ranch for 46 years. I know the value of water. We have a, we have a flowing well that goes through our uh, through the, uh, that flowing well that goes through our ranch. In Clearwater Creek, we have two of these artesian wells that bubble out of the ground. The most pure water you can ask for. The temperature of that water is 56 degrees winter and summer. Ideal place to winter job. You, can, you don't have to chop ice for them. It's a great a great situation. It is the cleanest, clearest water that there is. I've had it tested time and time again. It's 
absolutely 100% pure. There's not one thing in it that hurts anybody. And I don't want anything to be put in that hurt anybody. I do want to be put in it that hurt anybody. I do want to be put in it that hurt anybody. All the rest of the citizens, all the rest of the citizens deserve the very best. And I urge the city department to ask that this uh, Offer for this uh, pipeline to be around the office. Thank you. Thank you.